The horror streaming service Shudder is releasing a four-part docuseries this fall, just in time for, guess what, Halloween. Oh, wait, I'm sorry, gay Christmas. <laughs> the show is called Queer for Fear, the history of queer horror. Now, I have to say that because of my kind of weirdish Virginia Southern accent. The history of queer horror. Oh, not queer horror. <laughs> yes. Okay, exactly. okay, okay. Oh, because I was all interested <laughs> now. Like, <laughs> right. I was all no, excited. That's, that's this table. That's the round table. <laughs> right, exactly. All right. Well, this new documentary will explore important moments for the LGBTQ plus community in, say the word. Whores. Whores. <laughs> <laughs> Horror, 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 right, movies. <laughs> I'd swallow that. That's not ex exactly what I was expecting to be said. <laughs> I'd swallow that question number three. I love a good scare. And Shudder's Queer for Fear is going to do it for me. You agree with that? We all love horror, mm. don't we? Yeah. Horror. I, recently, I recently saw horror Peacock's movies. entry into the genre, which is called They Them, and it stars mm -hmm. Kevin Bacon Kevin and Bacon, Theo yes. Germain. Did you see it already? I did see it. Oh, you uh, saw the preview already. I mean, uh, beginning of August. And um, Oh, but you've seen the movie? I've seen it. Yeah. And you're going to have to wait for my review. And yeah. Movie. But um, tell us something. Yeah, give us a little I clue. I can't even do that. Really? Really? It's, now I'm going to oh, make fun of you forever. Like, now, I really and now it's like, time for another edging. <laughs> yes, exactly. Yeah. All right. Good. No, it's, you All know, right. there's, an embar dead. there's an embargo. Embargo. You're dead to me. Is <laughs> it, oh, Why? Uh, I'm curious. And, and it gives us the opportunity. Why is Halloween so important to LGBT? I think that it's an opportunity for people to... to put on a character to put to put on an identity to, to, to it's a form of escapism that I think mm -hmm. is so impactful for a lot more of than straight people yeah I mean there is there is so much for queer people to escape from in this world well, yeah it's yeah. the it's the day that straight people come to us yeah right yeah you know we spend our whole lives dressing up as something as something or someone else in we, their world in their mm -hmm. world and, and for that and time, they dress up for a night oh, that's and come an to interesting us. observation and and we always make the joke we've made the joke for years we all make the joke whether we're on a television show or not a television show that halloween is gay, gay christmas. christmas and what we're saying is to the straight community there is no greater holiday than christmas for the gay community we love christmas too by mm -hmm. the way i mean come on bangles gifts. and <laughs> and gifts and gifts yeah <laughs> we like i wasn't going that way but <laughs> I, but I say it. The like it. yeah the yeah the latina at the table <laughs> I like gifts and yes. money. So and if you want to send it, please go right ahead. <laughs> at Faye what? Did I? <laughs> wow, you just completely commandeered this, didn't you? Um, but for us, yeah. uh, Christmas is one thing, but Halloween is a whole different animal. And we reference that by saying Halloween is our gay, you know, gay Christmas. Uh, yeah, and for a lot of people that are not out of the closet, on that day, they get to be who they really are they inside. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, And it's okay. Yeah. And for all those women that are really whores inside, not horror, <laughs> whores inside, they get to be that whore that day. Let's you know? They can be horrors, too. Let's, let's plan ahead. Uh, what are we going to be doing for Halloween? I'm going to be a whore. I mean, no, I'm sorry. <laughs> Why is that day any different than And you were so today? quick to say it. Yeah, I know. Exactly. Oh, my God. All right. What are you going to do for Halloween? Something from Stranger Things. Let's dress up like that. Let's do something crazy. Yeah. yeah. Oh, I, I'm sorry. I can't hang out with no. you at Halloween this year. <laughs> Last year, I was the greatest Halloween costume oh ever. No, you weren't. I went to uh, was really Dakota, was and I was <laughs> Faye what? And huh? it's the first time Al, RuPaul, had ever done drag oh. ever. And what Are there pictures? the reason? Oh, there's great it pictures. Will go down and the reason it was so good is I was so bad. <laughs> I was so bad, which is exactly what Faye what is. <laughs> a mess. Long, it was a mess. Okay. Stringy, messy hair and and smudgy makeup and boobs oh. out to here. He was carrying around my dog. And, and, it was a and mess. her dog, uh, uh, Patai. <laughs> Uh, was uh, Pad Thai, right? Her name is Padme. <laughs> She's not named after a meal. Yeah, Pad Thai. And I, as I walked into uh, this big event for Halloween, I'm dragging the dog behind me, literally on its side. Oh. And, and people went... <gasps> <laughs> With a big sass that says Miss New Jersey, oh. Marico. He totally, <laughs> totally did that. Your smear. And I will never forget Faye's face when she first saw me because at first she did not realize who it was. <laughs> I was like, oh, he came as his mom. What's going on? Like, oh, oh, oh. And then I see the sass. Those and are see the dog and I go, oh, no, he did it. Oh, <laughs> ah. Last year I, I dressed up as a sexy plague mistress. 
Uh, so core, you, know, you see, cor corseted and whatnot. I think maybe this year I'm thinking like a Twinkie Ron DeSantis or something like that. I can't oh, think of anything yeah. more horrific. Yeah, that's so, that's that's horrifying. Yeah. yeah. Any any thoughts of what you're going to be for Halloween? Oh yeah, I already know. Ooh, you? Well, tell it? us. I'm going to dress up like a bird and put on big orange glasses and go as Owl Ferguson. <laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> Jesus, oh. did I walk into that. <laughs> Jesus. Uh, well, I'm sorry. I can't hang out with you because, <laughs> because I'm, I'm going to New Orleans for uh, Halloween to the French. NOLA! Party. But that's a whole Nola. experience. Oh, I've, and I've never done it. I, I've been to Mardi Gras so, so many times. I've never done Halloween. I can't wait. LGBTQ plus news is vital for our community and for the broader world as a whole. We have enough enemies at Fox News. Tucker, Sean, and Lara are loud. We need passionate allies. Happening Out Television Network, Queer News Tonight, and It's Happening Out are literally out of the closet and into the headlines. Our community needs your support. Like this broadcast and subscribe now to ensure the growth of the entire LGBTQ plus community.